So you're thinking about moving to Corsicana, Texas. In this video, I am going to take you around to see a little bit about what Corsicana is, what it offers, different attractions around here, so you can get a feel for the area. And if you stay around to the end, I will tell you about one of the biggest events we throw every single year here in Corsicana in April that brings people from all around the whole United States. And we're going to be getting to that right now. Now, if this is your first time to the channel and you want to know everything about eating, breathing, sleeping, dining, living inside of Corsicana, then subscribe below and tap the bell so you receive notifications so you know exactly what is going on inside of Corsicana and the surrounding market. My name is Mariah Zuniga. I'm with the Texas Living Realty Group here inside Corsicana, Texas. And we get calls, texts, email from people every single day just like you are looking to make a move to Corsicana, Texas, and we absolutely love it. So whether you were looking to make a move in nine or 90 days, give us a call, text, shoot us an email. All that information is in the description below so we can help you make your move to Corsicana, Texas as smooth as possible. So as I mentioned, we are inside of Corsicana, Texas. This town is centrally located about an hour south of Dallas, down 45, an hour east of Waco, in an hour and a half west of Tyler. And although there is a variety of reasons a lot of people would want to have moved to or visit Corsicana, Texas, one of the top reasons is that a lot of people say that usually stands out is a sense of community that we have here inside Corsicana. It's a lot of downtown, southern charm. A lot of history is here inside Corsicana, Texas. Let's speak a little bit on the history of Corsicana, Texas. Corsicana was founded in 1848 and it was utilized as a trading post. It wasn't until the early 1900s that Corsicana really hit its boom and its growth. This being because oil was found here, making it the oil capital of Texas. You will actually see some of these buildings still standing in operation. One being one I'm going to show you shortly is going to be the Palace Theater that you can actually see behind me. Like the Palace Theater and other top attractions inside of Corsicana, there's a lot to offer. I'm going to give you a couple. Nevera Vales Lake is one. It is about 15 minutes west of Corsicana. And there's camping, boating, fishing. It's a great recreational type lake that you can take the family out, camp overnight. The Pierce Museum at Navarro College is another one where they showcase the history and the culture of Texas. Then you have Collins Street Bakery. We actually have two locations, one here inside of Corsicana off of 7th and one off 45. If you ever heard of the famous fruitcakes, that is us and you can get them actually sampled here inside of either one of the shops at Collins Street Bakery. Another one that has experienced a bunch of growth here recently is going to be the Corsicana Opry and Event Center. We have a new steakhouse in there and also a awesome creamery that I love taking the family to. They do different karaoke and live shows in there throughout the years. Another one's going to be the Pioneer Village. You do not see a place like this anywhere. They have actually recreated the Pioneer Settlement. And like I mentioned, another one's going to be the Palace Theater right behind me. It's one of the original buildings here inside of Corsicana, but they do different events throughout the year and usually they are sold out. Another thing about Corsicana that is talked about is going to be the cost of living here. Corsicana definitely has a lower cost of living in compared to other places across the nation. In 2022, in Corsicana 75110 zip code, the median sales price here was $220,000. With the conversation on the cost of living though, also comes in the conversation of job opportunities here. Corsicana definitely has a diverse economy with job opportunities in a variety of industries. A lot of the top employers here are going to be in manufacturing, they're going to be in healthcare, education, retail, and some of the largest employers here inside Corsicana are going to be Con Tree Bakery, it's going to be Corsicana ISD or Navarro Regional Hospital. Additionally though, because Corsicana is located centrally where it is, we get a lot of people that move here and they don't mind the extra commute to Dallas or Waco or Tyler of the surrounding area. I said we're just a short drive south of Dallas, down 45, east or west on Highway 31 to Waco or Tyler. So many of those people, they do commute, which provides the best of both worlds for the small town living, but being in proximity where they could commute for those opportunities work-wise. Some of the other key features I want to talk about besides just the top attractions are going to be some different things that you can find and do around Corsica. Canada, Texas. I'm walking down our historical Main Street right now. It's full of different boutiques, but it's not only that of boutiques and restaurants, wineries, breweries, a lot of life here. 
There's also a lot of different events that are thrown here in our downtown community as well. Some of the events that you'll see throughout the year are going to be mimosas on market where they gather on the Saturdays. The boutiques downtown have their doors open. You could do some shopping, have some free light refreshments. You also have Boo on the Block. At Halloween time, you have the Christmas tree lighting, which is a great festival. Food Truck Friday, the first Friday of every single month. And like I was mentioning, the one thing that I said if you stay to the end is going to be our huge Derek Days Festival. It celebrates oil being struck here inside Corsicana, usually block down the whole downtown area. They have countless number of food trucks. They have different kind of games, tournaments going on, learn a little bit about the history, meet a lot of the locals in the area. I mean, this event brings thousands and thousands of people all across the whole United States here for this festival. It's about two to three days, start on the evening time, and they have um, food trucks coming out here. They have a dance party. They have stuff for the kids and the family. I mean, it's definitely an event that if you're wanting to experience Corsicana for Corsicana and what it has to offer, you've definitely got to come to that event. That's just my nibbit of a little bit about the Corsicana, Texas, what it has to offer, what there is to do about living, and just Corsicana as a whole. Love if you came down and visited, or if you have any other questions, you let me know. But also, again, stay tuned for all videos about Corsicana and the surrounding areas. My name is Mariah Zuniga, Texas Living Realty Group. Thanks for watching.